Okay, I've, um, I've been asked uh, a great question on um, people, spiritual, spiritual, spiritual people who seem detached versus uh, people who are at a, a high spiritual level of consciousness but do not seem detached. And as you start to do your spiritual work, you start to release certain layers of the ego. And often when you're going to the observer of things like relationships, money, success, uh, environments, work, um, you may be perceived by people uh, in the early stages as being detached. But however, you are at a higher level of consciousness and so you will be benefiting both yourself and others because you'll not be in so much negativity and so the light emits out into the, into the universal field. So there is this support but there may be judgment from others that what, you seem detached and not so compassionate and loving. Uh, the way, as you, what happens with that is you keep, just keep going to the observer of things and um, often whether the final state of consciousness as you release layers of your ego, whether the, uh, whether the, uh, the play of your beingness displays as being detached or not being detached is up to the universe. However, what can make a lot of people seem detached is yet they have not yet let go of all of the layers of their ego. So if you're feeling detached as you're doing observer work, keep going to the observer of that which is feeling detached and sometimes this, these feelings of detachment will dissolve and that this may correlate to other people no longer seeing you as detached, maybe as more warm, compassionate and yet non-attached to how the world operates and, and how uh, events change and people change around you. So that can be a different correlation. Another aspect to this is some people are very um, kind in their actions but are not having high levels of peace and serenity and uh, witnessing occurring in their consciousness. So these people might be pleasant to be around in terms of being around them, in terms they might be uh, nice in their actions but they won't be emitting so much light and there'll be less of a tendency uh, to feel uh, relaxed or to feel invigorated. I know when I used to uh, go and meet uh, Muji or uh, Do Dr. David R. Hawkins, in their presence, whether they said much or didn't say anything at all and just sat there silent, uh, an overwhelming uh, bliss and stillness would come upon me. Now this does not, uh, if I just meet nice people who are just nice, this overwhelming state of bliss doesn't come upon me. So this means that the inner stillness of the person you're around is more important than whether they seem uh, detached or not.